Hello dear Detroit Do friends, welcome to the 11th video of Ultimate Detroit Do. I'm smiling here because it's the only thing left to do. I'm trying to make this freaking video now for the whole freaking day. No chance until now, but I make this video. I make it now and I make it today. I'm even more motivated now. What happened? Biplanes passing me over thousands of other airplanes and passengers and cars and farmers with their machines and people coming what you're doing here you cannot do this you have to go oh oh <laughs> and rain of course doesn't matter why i want to make this video so badly is it's about life and today came a big load of life A didgeridoo teacher from Canada wrote me and asked politely if I can explain to him in detail the, that's what he says, mechanics of, un, uh, of negative pressure breathing. I wrote him back, of course I will do this uh, in a time and yes, I was doing it in the last 10 videos and there will come more but what keeps me all the time busy in brain is mechanics I would have asked the same years before no doubt about that just the mechanics how is it technical stuff now as I I think fully understood now uh, the negative pressure breathing I see there is no question of mechanics or technical stuff it's a question of passion of course you have to know how it works but then this is the message of this video why I want to make it so good also is I was almost dead several times so I don't know if I have still the big fear of death but what really pisses me off sorry is the imagination not to be able to breathe anymore when dying I hope nature has a good trick about this so you can bear it but only the thought of it just to stop breathing and then the lights go out is a bit cruel to me I don't like it negative pressure breathing to me is not as you may have understood it until now is not another technique another weird crazy crazy thing that the aborigines do or not do it's uh, difficult so hmm, I don't know if I want to do it better I stick with my modern playing maybe you think thoughts like that it would be a pity I see negative pressure breathing now as it's a celebration of life every breath every suck you take every sound you make by it is life is oxygen is filling you up not only i have to say it like modern players do in the head area but right through your body right through your bones every cable every i don't know what you call the cables where the blood goes through into the toes and then expand yourself as i explain in the next video it's breathing pure essence of life oxygen this is what it's about it's not technical it's 
enjoy that you are living and enjoy the sounds that you are able to make through breathing by breathing um, this is so essential for me now this is all that matters I strongly believe people stop playing the ditch forever because they never had that feeling they play the cheap ditch that gives nothing with breathing techniques that don't make anything uh, for you no euphoria no high you know what I mean high by oxygen Charlie McMahon is a highly respected player by me and he had this nice uh, saying oxygen pie it's good for you I like that but I see it not only as a little oxygen pie that would be not enough I see it as you suck in the whole yes why not universe you are a breathing organism you are pure life vitality strong enjoying this this is the message of this video you have now the mechanics of it you will get more mechanics of it but this is not not the thing you need it but then remember what I told you in this video be happy that you are alive and enjoy every breath deep demonstrate deep passive breathing and deep un, um, negative pressure breathing more, more. very not into the lungs only in the whole body <clears throat> and more than that if you play it let's say for one two three or ten minutes you are filling up with positive energy like crazy it's energizing like you only have it in sports sports do the same for you if you have a hard performance and you are breathing very deeply um, only when playing the ditch your heart rate does not need to go up so much um, so you have a very interesting way of just filling you up with energy without necessarily sweating and heart rate going up I think you got the message. See you in the next video. Bye.